It's Fandom Friday! Yeah! Hey guys, welcome in. I'm Zorad of Doom. I'm a singer, songwriter, and I make content here on YouTube. Mainly reactions. I also stream on Twitch. Mainly video games and chatting with chat. Catching up with you guys if you want to hang out there. Links are down in the description or to the side in the description. Anywhere the description is right now. But anyways, if you are here, you notice the title. It is another Fandom Friday. I will be doing a reaction. Be first adjacent to one of the members of Be First was on a feature for one of Pseudo's songs. So the song is called Kyoto, and I have heard a few songs by Pseudo before, but I think they've mainly been collaboration. So I'm curious what Ryoki is going to sound on this. I have a hunch that he's going to be rapping, but I don't know if he'll be doing more than that. And usually when it comes to pseudo videos, I've noticed that a lot of them are animated. So that's also what I'm kind of expecting just based on the thumbnail. But yeah, I'm really excited to check this out. It has been a long time coming. Here we go. In three, two, and one. Ooh. 3D animation as well. Love this type of lyric video. Also, the art style looks very familiar. Getting idol vibes here. That was cool! I had to pause it right where the thumbnail was. I really love this kind of lyric video because it, it's very entertaining to the eyes, right? And the words are all over the place. You can see the characters everywhere. So it's difficult to, to just read. Like if you're looking at this lyric video to just read it, might as well just go to a website that has the lyrics already. Having a video like this stylized where the letters are everywhere and spinning around like crazy, I'm obsessed with that kind of topography. It doesn't look like there are subtitles, 
The video heavily reminds me of Macaque City Actors. Days, I believe, is the theme song by Jin, uh, Feet Maria. I really, really like this art style because you have the 2D in the forefront, 3D in the background, but it doesn't look wrong, if that makes sense. It's interesting to see the journey of the characters where it seemed like the, the purple haired character sort of like helped defend the blue green haired character. It's also interesting that he's using the pipe like a baseball bat and it's a baseball stadium that they're sort of like jumping with fireworks in the background just based on the way that the song sounds and it seems like a song that talks about struggles or help connect through the struggles and the pain that you're sort of going through and that's how you connect and create new bonds, if that makes sense, is what I'm sort of getting. Because there seems to be like this little rivalry between them just based on this. It's kind of cute. The struggles of youth, I guess. What do you guys think? And for anyone who does and would like to help me understand the lyrics, help me understand the story of the video itself, I would love to hear it. Leave it in the comments and yeah. I think that is it for this reaction. Thank you so much for those who are still here, who wanted to stick around to hear what I had to say by the end, because the video itself is beautiful. The song itself is hype. I'm adding it to my playlist 110%. Anyways, guys, that is it for me. If you like this kind of content, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and give me those comments. I wanna know what I should react to next, or if there's anything else that I have missed from what B First, the members have been doing separately, would love to know in the comments. Anyways, guys, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week and don't forget that no matter how it is you're feeling, you are a -E -S -O -M -E. you are a -E -S -O -M -E. All right, guys, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.